my name is Courtney, welcome back to my channel and I hope you were doing so very well. Well today on my channel is a unboxing. If you haven't heard I made it into Jane Davenport's design team and I am now a Davin peep and my box, my design team box arrived. Now I asked Jane if she would like me to do an unboxing because inside is her entire range of art supplies that is now being stocked in Michaels and will also be stocked on her website for us Aussies and anyone else who doesn't have access to Michaels. So she was very happy for me to show you the entire range. Now this box, all I've done is open it because as you can see there's a lot of tape going on here and I didn't want to struggle but the box is quite large so I may have to put it on the ground and pull things out so you can guys, you guys can get a proper look because it's quite high up on my desk and my tripod is at its highest level so I I think the best thing for me to do is pop it on the floor and then pull things out. So this is currently what it looks like. As you can see, there's a couple of things popping out there, but that is all I can see. It's all I've seen for the last half an hour as I get ready to film for you guys. But um, yes, let's pop this on the ground and start pulling things out, shall we? Be right back. First up, what I've pulled out of the box is collage papers. Now these look stunning. I am a rainbow fanatic. Um, I don't know if I can pull them out. So I might, I might actually just leave them in the box for now. Um, but these would look like the designs. I don't want to pull everything out of their boxes just in case. So there is a little sneak peek. They feel like napkins or serviettes which are fantastic. I'll just give you a sneak peek of the ones that are on here. Oh my goodness. These are fantastic for using um, and layering in your art journals. Jane loves to use uh, paper serviettes and napkins in her journal and I am so impressed that she got her designs put onto napkins. Look at these. So you know you would layer them down in with matte medium and just work away at them. So there are quite a few designs. So I'll show you here. So these are collage papers. So very cool. That is the first thing that I've pulled out of the box. There is quite a lot of bits and pieces in here. So just bear with me as I pull things out. Then we have aqua brushes. So you have a fine brush and a broad brush. They're kind of like your Pentel Aquash brushes, but obviously I trust Jane's brushes quite a lot more. So um, they are there and they will be great to test out for you guys. I will be doing lots more videos and in-depth videos on this sort of stuff like looking at different things, swatching things for you guys, but that's, this is just an unboxing. So I'm going to give you, you know, show you what's in the range, especially for the Aussies who can't physically see them because they are just being stocked at Jane's website. So this is, this is for you Aussie girls. This is the next item to come out of the box. It is confetti tissue. And I do know that Jane is making a free video series featuring this cutie patootie little item. I just, the, the packaging, the packaging. I can't see it all but in the box but every time I pull it out I gasp. You don't hear that because I've been doing, um, my husband went and made me a cup of tea so I've been looking at this because it's the only thing on my desk. Her packaging, Jane, you're spot on with your packaging. It is so beautifully done, so visually appealing and from what I can see that's in this box every single item has been carefully carefully packaged because I know how much packaging means to me as a buyer. If something looks good in the package and the packaging is well thought out I know that the item that's in the actual package is totally worth it and this if I saw if I saw this um, in like a spotlight store I would pick it up because I'm a sucker for beautiful packaging and this is so so cute I can't wait to play with these little confetti bits that are adorable so moving on I have a cup of tea next to me now because it's very very early in the morning so my husband made me a cup of tea. Oh my goodness. This is so, so cute. 
I see I don't know everything that's in the range I've just been seeing the releases from Jane's Instagram even though I'm a design team member I don't know everything that's in the range so this is just as exciting for me as it probably is for you guys watching this is a journal girdle so I imagine I'm gonna pull this one out I imagine it is um, like the ones that you pop onto your journal and you can I should pull it all out because it's attached yes it is so let me pull that out it's got an elastic on the back so you can pop it onto your actual journal and it has got a little uh, zipper pouch for you to pop in your favorite pens your water brushes and just attach that to the cover of your journal but swatches man swatches are my favorite things to look at so that is adorable that is the journal girdle next I'm going to pull out I don't know what I'm gonna pull out Ooh. These are acrylic rubber stamps. So awesome. I love that. So this one is a full face stamp. So if you're worried that you can't draw a face or you're still in the learning pro processes, this is great for helping you work out where things need to be. This is a slightly turned face, which are the hardest to do for me personally. So this is fabulous. So you can see, um, you can stamp it out and either try and you know, mimic where the you know, proportions are and where the features are. Fantastic, love that one a lot. I can see me using that one heaps. And this is even cooler. This is like a build your own face. You have one, two, three, four sets of eyes, four different noses and four sets of lips and a full face with your eyebrows drawn in. So you can change the way your face looks depending on which um, stamp set you use. That is really, really cool. And this is something, of course, for someone who's learning or someone that just doesn't think they can draw and Jane will tell you differently. She can get anyone to draw. So that is so cool. I can't wait to play with that. I cannot wait. Imagine you can do one with their eye open, one with their eyes closed. That is gonna be something very cool to play with. So there's those. Um, what else? What else? I can't really see because the box is so huge. Now, I may, I actually messaged Jane and said, please tell me we're getting the washi tapes because this was the thing I was most excited about. As a planner girl, traveler's notebook girl, washi tape, I love washi tape and I saw the cool washi tape that she did and look, look. I'm gonna do a close-up of the washi tape because it needs a close-up, so give me a second. These look amazing. So you've got little bodies up, to, up here, watercolor swatches, faces, and more watercolory bodies here in this tube. That is so cool. So cool. Planner girls, you are going to go gaga over this. Actually, just anyone. Washi tape admirers, journal girls, art girls. And there is also a smaller one in there which looks like watercolor rainbow thinner tape. So these two are thinner and these ones are a little bit wider in size. So that is pack one. These ones are another set and as you can see, they have faces on them, oh, it's so cool. This is gonna look amazing in our journals. I, I love Jane, I've always loved Jane, but even if I didn't know Jane from, you know, no one, I would buy these in a heartbeat. I, I was like, do we get them? Because if we don't get them, I have to order them from you because I need the washi tapes. They are so, so cool and I can't wait to pull them apart. You're gonna see some journal with me's on my channel using these supplies and I can cannot wait to put those in my journal. They really, they really inspire me, these ones especially. This is the other set. This looks like watercolor swatches in your cools and warms. So they will look awesome on your as journal borders as, and photo borders, tip-ins. They're going to look fantastic. And I think that's all for the washi tape, but I'm not quite sure because I can't see into the box. I'm just pulling things out. But that is the three sets of washi tape that I have pulled out so far. I can't get my camera to focus for you guys. There we go. They are really cool. I would... 
I, I love them. So I'll put them on the side so you can see into them all. But they are the three sets of washi tape. So, so cool. I love these the most so far. This is my favorite thing so far. Moving right along, I think Jane, from what I can see in the box, which I'm going to pull out, Jane is created her own traveler's notebooks. And so this is a beautiful charm. Actually, I think there's another one of these. I think I, think I saw. Or maybe, I think there's more than one charm in here like more than one set and I think they all coincide. So in this one you get a beautiful um, girl charm with the lobster class and you get the blue, the coral and the green. And it says use with your butterfly book. So this is a charm set and these are the butterfly books. Oh my god! They are so beautiful! Now they do come already elasticized I'm going to pull one of these out because I know you guys are going to want to see this. I'm just double checking. Okay, so this one is a butterfly book that is plain so you can paint your own. And this has a turquoise elastic. And this is, okay, I'm going to pull out the prints for you so you can see them. But oh my goodness, they look so vibrant. And they are got a good structure to them as you can see they do come with an insert and they have two elastics so let me pull this out for you guys so you can see so you have two elastics in there comes with an insert and this is the outside of them so nice so nice and vibrant so there is one of the prints this is probably my favorite look at that it is so stunning and the print is double sided so you have the print on both both sides so the blue girl comes with a um, turquoise elastic the three lovely ladies come with a pink elastic and the mermaid girl comes with a purple elastic and then obviously the charm sets go with the butterfly books and I'm pretty sure there is another one in here I just can't see it I don't know I'm not quite sure so these are covers used with your butterfly book. So I am going to show you. It's all on the fly, guys, all on the fly. So this is um, a little introduction to the butterfly book. The butter Welcome to the Butterfly Effect book. Oh, man, Jane, you are so good with your words. So... This here is a cover that has an imprint on it, like you can see. So if you want to keep your journal um, clean, and obviously with the fabric dories, I'm assuming this would maybe go with the plain one. So in the Butterfly Effect system, you have stencils and washi tape holders, watercolor and marker paper, pockets and pouches, charm and band sets. So I'm assuming in my box there will be these sorts of things. So there is a whole system to go with this. So cool. So also you have holes in your covers if you want to re-thread there so you can see those there but obviously there's more in there but I will get them out but they are stunning if you're not into the leather um, Midori system or you're a vegan or you're just um, you really not into leather this this is a beautiful way to go absolutely beautiful way to go so there's that and obviously you have the plain one as well so nice I'm running out of room on my desk I put those over there so I think ooh, how cool this is a pencil pouch oh that is nice so that this is made of like a it's not fabric but it feels like it's got a coating on it so it'll be easy to be wiped off 
it is a bit fabricy inside, so inside won't wipe off, but this definitely will be wipeable. So that is really cute with the tassel. So beautiful and vibrant. Love that. Love those colors. So there are pencil pouches available in there. Well, in my box anyway. So beautiful if you're looking for a cute pencil case. This is a great gift actually. So there's that. Uh, let's see what else. What else can I drag out of the box? I think I saw more washi tape. Or well, maybe I didn't. Oh, what are these? So these are washi tape strips. Washi tape. Oh, these are cute. So these, let me uh, turn my autofocus on, are the washi tape strip patterns that you get. And there's a close up of them there. They are so cute. So portable too. So you can pop those into your Midori pockets. Very, very travel friendly. And you know, we're always making little washi tape cards, sample cards. So this is really, really thin. So that'd be great for travel. So, so beautiful. And these I think are washi tape as well. Let me just double check. Journal tape strips. So here are the beautiful journal tape strips. So I imagine they work like the washi tape as well. So lovely. I really do love text. Creativity equals joy. Most definitely. Miss Jane, most definitely. So they are there. There may be others in the set. I just can't grab them. So there's those two for now. So, so cool. This is like Christmas for me. Absolutely. I've just had Christmas. Oh, there's another set. So, uh, let me see. Where did I pop the charm set? The other charm set so you can see the difference. So these are two of the charm sets for the butterfly effect journals. So beautiful. Those charms are so cool. I can see everyone adoring those charms. Because charms are very in at the moment in the Traveler's Notebook community. Now I can see a big book. Is that it for the books? No. Okay. This, oh my goodness, is a canvas journal. And this one's a plain one, so a really big plain one. So we might do a video covering that one. But look. This is a six by nine inch. This is a nine by 12. I'm just checking if it tells you what kind of paper is in it. We might open it up and see what kind of paper is in it. Because if I know Miss Jane, but look at the cover on that. That is stunning, stunning. Why have a black one if you can have one of these? Pause the video and I'll get this open. <laughs> okay, I've moved the big one out of the way for now. And this is beautiful, beautiful canvas. And then on the inside, this is how your um, book ends and papers look. And then you have really beautiful, thick paper. And now I know Jane, one of Jane's mottos is life's too short for crappy paper. So I knew that her journals would have beautiful paper just it's smooth but has a tiny bit of texture so so lovely and that is so cool look at that it's the details man it's the details it's those little details that you just know this is the back of the journal so when you open it up this is how it looks oh my goodness Jane you have outdone yourself uh, you were, were the perfect person for Michaels to pick perfect person and obviously the plain one is just plain which I assume is for you to paint your own cover um, and that sort of thing so we may do a video later on painting those covers but stunning so I will move these out of the way I'm running out of desk space and um, I will dive in and grab some other things for you I have just removed the side stickers so that I could show you guys the beautiful beautiful papers 
uh, this is just a sneak peek of what's on the cover but these are like scrapbook papers things to you oh I haven't even looked at this this is my first look um, they are really beautiful they are one-sided so you do not have to choose your favorite I hate it when companies put it double-sided I understand the point of it but sometimes you have two beautiful patterns on both sides and you have like struggle street and you don't know how to pick but these look at them oh my goodness collage girls you are going to lose it over these I am a collage girl at heart and these papers make me so happy. Oh, I love it. I love it. They are perforated so you can pull them out with ease. Oh, swatches. So beautiful. This video is going to be so long, but it's so, so worth it. Make time for your art. I need to cut that out and put that in my journal. Guys, you need one of everything. You need one of everything. So beautiful. Oh, I love that. I remember this journal <laughs> oh I love her so that you get two sets of those designs so I think yes so you get two sets of each piece of paper does it have how many designs there so there are 48 pieces so there's 24 designs in the pad and you get two of each so stunning one of the best paper pads if not the best paper pad I have seen to date Oh, so pretty. So there is the scrapbook papers. Oh my goodness, I need to take a tea break because this is overwhelming and so, so beautiful. So I'll be back in a second. I've pulled a few things out of the box because um, my arm was trying to reach over and I was grabbing nothing because we're getting to the bottom. So these are Jane's paints. Now there are three sets that I have received. So this is one, two, and one. So there are two number ones and this is number two. So these are base paints. So in here you get matte, medium, and gesso. And she's got them called gesso and matte, medium. So those two are there. So you grab those in a two pack. And then two sets of acrylic paints. I think there's more in the range. I can't quite remember. I'm trying to remember her Instagram post. But these ones have beautiful pale colors and these ones I love. Just popping it in here that in each set of the acrylic paints you also get a bonus stencil and paintbrush. They can be seen in this little freeze frame and I didn't realize that until after I was editing the video and opened up the boxes. This blue here, this inky blue is Stunning. and I love that these are the actual colors of the paint so these are um, clear bottles so you can see how much you've got left you can see the actual color and they are very very cool so two sets of paint and then some base ones as well so they are there so I'll just pop them over here because I have not much room left and there is another journal girdle in gold so you have the gold one or you have the cute if i try and pull it out it might have an avalanche nope so there's the two different ones a gold one and the swatchy one i love the swatchy one because i am a color girl but very very cute either way so there's those two and so with the butterfly book there is quite a few little bits and pieces to the whole set um, from what I have seen come out of the box. So these are pockets and it says use with your butterfly book. So I'm going to open these up for you guys so you can see. But they're <laughs> so cool. So they're like your folders that you get from the Midori Traveler's Notebook. 
so they open like so so these are the pocket bit so so cool so you have so let's open up this so I can get a book Pockets and pouches. These printed pockets are great for taking a few supplies in your journal or to store keepsakes and items you want to use in your art. Pouches are the perfect size to, source, to store stickers, washi or finished 4x4 four four photos. So in here she's got, so because they are like this you can store some supplies. You can store um, ephemera, which is what we most of most of us do. So pockets on either side. There is you cannot get to them from this side. So this side there is nothing, but you have these sides that have the two pockets. So this is one of the prints. So so beautiful. This is the green one, very, very ocean inspired. This is the beautiful purple one. Stunning, absolutely stunning. And this is the yellow one. So there comes four to a pack and you can pop them into the elastics on your butterfly book. So there's those. Then she has watercolor papers. So I assume these are also for the butterfly book system. So they are folded, they're not bound. Folded watercolor. I wonder if they fit into this pocket. Nope. So you have watercolor papers. And so let's read. The perfect paper for creating beautiful paintings with your favorite mediums. So it does, you can slip these into the elastics as so, if you don't want to bind them or you want to pull them out. So there is watercolor paper and there is marker paper. So she's given me two, two watercolor papers and one marker paper. So those there, and it does say use with your butterfly book. There's no reason why you can't just buy these singly as well just pop those together i have to keep everything together so i know what goes with what and then these are stencil and washi holder so let me clear folded stencils that you can take on the go to set up your color palette or begin drawing washi holders organize and provide a place in your journal to always keep your favorite washi with you so I will open just one of these because I've got two. Oh, so. So this is for washi tape. So I imagine, imagine you put your washi tape around here. Um, it's all new to me guys, all new to me. So these are your stencils, same size as your inserts. Very cool. And they can be popped in like that, so they can go as a duo. And there are circles and squares and triangles down below and a rectangle. And on this one, I was only gonna show you one, but I'll show you both because this one's quite beautiful. So you have a, each set comes with its own washi tape holder and then this one comes with a floral. So let me pull these out to the side so you can see them on my desk. Nope, you can't. So how can I show you best? Can you see? Nope. This will be a hard one to show, but there are floral prints. There we go, show you in the light. Floral prints on each side of the stencils. So you can put those into your, uh, your butterfly book. So they go together like so. You can probably put them all together as one. 
and take them all like that on one elastic if you wanted to. And I think that is all for the butterfly book. So you have the wash, the stencil and washi tape holders, the water and marker paper, the pockets and pouches, and the charm and band sets, and obviously the covers themselves. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I will do another video later on showing you it all together and working as a complete system and show you them as well. So how they get put together. Beautiful. Love these. They're so bright. Okay. I only have a few things left. I've pulled some of them out onto my desk to make it easier. Uh, with the other acrylic stamps, this is another set that came out of the box. And these are four different faces. You have a turned face, a slightly turned face, so a front on face and different proportions. They are very cool, especially if you want to do cute girls. Even though I can draw cute girls, I would still use these in a pinch just to save time. Something different. You can do some really cool effects with these. So we'll be working with these on my channel as well. These these make me happy. I love rub-ons. I really, really do. And Jane's made three sets of rub-ons, or three that I've received, and they are so cool. So I will show you. I'm not going to open them up, because if I open everything, I'm going to lose everything. So there are the two prints that you get in this set. So there's the front cover, and there's what you get on the back. Then there is the swatches, and you get two sets of swatches or very rainbow itis and then these these are so cool these are little hand drawn faces over color swatches oh and then the other one that you get are faces well, not faces but like facial features lips and noses and eyes so that you can rub, rub them on and create a face so very cool love those so they are the rub-ons that I received. I am going to have so much fun with these. My journal is going to be bursting with goodness. Okay, so next up we have, I saw these. These are the mermaid markers. They look stunning. Oh, they are pre-filled watercolor brush pens are the perfect travel companion. And as you can see, the colors there are so stunning. So you have some beautiful blues, greens, purples, reds, peaches, and a black. I'm not going to open these up just yet, but they are so, so beautiful. There's those. And then we have <clears throat> the Incredible Pen. So this is a fountain pen by the look of it. Pen, converter, three ink cartridges. I imagine the ink would be waterproof. I will test that at a later date, but that is very cool. So you have all those types of things and then a converter means that you can add your own ink as well if you see fit. That is cool. And I did get a little, um, bundle with cartridges which I assume are uh, for this pen because they look like the same type in um, some colors so let me just pull those out so you can see they almost match the mermaid pens so you have some pinks a purple a red some blues and greens so I go put those together with that so oop, so lovely so lovely hubby's probably think I've you know gone or he's in the lounge room oh so these I've been waiting for these these are her watercolor sets I am going to open one of them I'll open the go oh, no I'll open the bright one so I will get my scissors out and open up the packaging first and then I'll come back okay I am losing light we've had a huge heat wave here in Australia and then all of a sudden after the heat wave broke we have a very overcast days and it's starting to rain. So I'm trying to trying to hurry along for you guys. Now I opened up the box um, and pulled out the bright palette. So this comes in the beautiful turquoise tin and you have the little thumb ring on the back if you want to hold it like that. So beautiful tins. 
and then they open up like so and you can see the colors beautifully wrapped with the names on them and I am sure Jane had a blast naming her watercolors. So this is the bright palette. You get Ladybug, Buzzy, Butterfly, 70s Eyeshadow, Mermaid, Jiminy, Best Friend, Fairy Tale, Frida, Mystic, Royal and Ink in the bright palette and she said this palette of fine watercolors features three primaries so your ladybug your buzzy and your butterfly will be your primaries so you can mix any color and some of my favorite hues use the reverse of this card to make a handy reference i hope this fine little set of watercolors brings you big joy so on the back you have your paint swatch which is very very cool and the names are there for you as well paint till you're faint so very cute i will be doing swatches of these in another video this is purely an unboxing um and obviously there are 12 colors in the neutral set as well but i'm not going to open those just yet and that comes in the gold tin but so very adorable so they are the watercolors so i'm going to move those out of the way And there is a, I did find a third, no, a fourth set of washi tape. So in here, I'm going to do a close up like I did with the others. So just a second. So up close, you can see there's some mermaids there, some beautiful fonts, some florals. So, so pretty. The washi tapes are going to be fantastic. And I can see myself reaching for these in my journals. So if you're a washi tape fan, you need all of them. Um, I think they are stunning. And I cannot wait to pull them apart and see what they really look down on paper. Again, I'll be making videos of these things on my channel for you guys to see at a later date. But for now, we are just doing the unboxing. Okay, I think I've got two more things to show you guys. These are the colored pencils, also known as the magic wands. And they are beautifully packaged, so I will pull them out if I can. Um, I'm not going to open the tin just yet, but this is how they will come to you. It's stunning, stunning tin. You have all the colors down there. Actually, maybe I will open them. I'm a sucker. I will open this off camera, I think. Hold on. Yes, I'll open this off camera and I'll show you what's inside. Okay, so I've taken the plastic packaging off the tin and this are the pencils or magic wands as Jane calls them. They are beautiful in rainbow formation. They have their own colors. They have their own color names. Again, I know that Jane would have had a blast naming all these colors. She is very creative in how she names things, always has been, even in her classes. So I will be doing swatches and things of these later on. I will do single swatches, so one video will be, you know, colored pencil swatches, watercolor swatches, paint swatches, all that sort of thing. There will be a whole range of different videos coming to my channel to show you guys up close. So they are the beautiful magic wands and the tin is just stunning. If I can say one thing, Jane has made the whole range so visually appealing to the buyer um, and that is such an important thing in the whole buying process. You're wanting to buy something beautiful and I can safely say that Jane has done that. Us as artists and creators are drawn to colour and every ounce of color is just dripping from her items it is so so beautiful and i highly highly commend her for how she has created this whole range um i have one more uh well two more things to show you but then i am done and i am just blown away by the pure beauty and vibrancy and the cool things that have just been missing in the craft world um, I just I think that she's found a nook 
all to her own and she is just going to do amazing amazing things from here on out and I am so so very proud of her as a as an Aussie and I know that there are many many Aussies out there that are stupidly proud of what she's done so they are the beautiful magical wands and then last but not least these are the journal jackets now these are to go with I am assuming because they are the same sizes six by nine so they are to go over your beautiful canvas covers to stop them from getting dirty this one actually has a saying on it and it says it's not about the destination it's about the journal so that one is for this one and the clear one is um the bigger size is for the bigger journal it has nothing on it so if you do put something on your journal here on this one you can then put your cover over it and your artwork will still shine through so they are the journal jackets in the 6.9 and the 9 by 12 and that my loves is everything that came in my design team box it is amazing I cannot wait to show you guys more I am so very grateful to have been chosen I know that she was absolutely flooded with applications so the fact that my little work my you know scrap monsters was one of the things I put forward um, as my project um, so I am very very proud that my work was um, quirky and creative enough for the design team so i cannot wait to show you guys more in-depth videos with this stuff using this stuff journal with me speed videos it's all gonna happen on my channel um so i cannot wait cannot wait i hope you guys enjoy this video is there something in the range that you've seen that you go i need that is it all of the things because i think it's all of the things pop your comment down below i want to know what is your favorite thing that i've showed you town down below let's start a conversation about supplies supplies are one of my favorite things to talk about and i this has been the best day it's like second christmas second christmas has come but yes pop your favorite thing down below i want to see what your favorite thing is is it the same as mine i actually don't know which is my favorite because i'm so overwhelmed the washi tapes have really stolen my heart i will say that i i do do love a good washi tape so thank you so much for joining me i hope you guys are very well i hope you had a wonderful christmas and 2017 is going to be a very 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 colorful year thanks for watching bye so so i have my jelly rolls uh is that all of them okay so i have they're different they're all different see they're all different shades i really only need two okay two i need to pick two oh, this one and this one so these can get put away 